Sarah? Lil Sis! How can JD be ready for kindergarten so soon? <laughs> it's so hard to pick the right school. You know you have to visit the schools in person, right? And I don't mean like this. <laughs> but I don't even know what I'm looking for. On great schools, I read about three things to look out for. Number one, engaged kids. Lots of schools will let you inside a class or two, but try to peek into as many as you can. Look at kids' faces. Do they look like this? Or this? Don't judge too quickly, but if you see a few classes where half the kids look bored or disengaged, beware. Good teachers engage their students most of the time. Number two, look for high expectations, and I mean everywhere. For instance, Great School says that nonfiction writing can tell you tons about a school's academic expectations. They say you should look for examples of fourth or fifth grade writing, or ask for a sample if you have to, and then compare them to the ones on the site. And while we're on the subject of high expectations, check out the bathrooms. Good schools will have high expectations for students, teachers, even the custodian. So look at the hallways and the cafeterias too. Finally, number three, Look for positive school climate. Be sure to check out recess. It can tell you a lot about the school climate. How do people treat each other? Look for the bad and the good. Wow, finding a school isn't what it used to be. Mom never had to do all of this. Thanks, sis. I owe you. Today was the first day of kindergarten and someone has a message for you. Remember to look out for engaged kids, high expectations, and positive school climate.